Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Griffin Writers of Marvel. This should be episode 7, I want to say. If this is your first time seeing this, there's a playlist in the description. And leave a like if you enjoy the video. In the last one, we flipped Coronite. Woo! Is my... What's the word? Coalition gone? Eh, mostly. I just reloaded the game, so... It's probably going to go away soon. We have this... What's this guy? He got rid of my air. What a butthole. What a butthole. You know what? I'm going to curry favors with you. I'm going to try to do it again. Surf's properly exploited. Our policy of serfdom has yielded results, as our landowners have recently made extra special efforts to exploit their serfs. Good to produce. Okay, that is a global modifier, not a local one. Nice. We are cold converting some stuff. These guys are the wrong religion. <laughs> Isn't that fun? Yeah. So we have some goblins. They're getting cult converted. Well, those are forest goblins. That's a little different. We'll keep the common goblins. We'll keep the green orcs around. I don't think either of these guys will be able to form Ungoldover. Hopefully they won't. We are trying to get this guy to be a vassal. Which will be fine, but like, we'll eventually, we'll eventually get there, but we need to be a lot bigger. Same with you, actually. They're about the same size. Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to work on trust. If I get trust up, that'll make that easier. The levy. You know what? They can be mad. Huh. Promise done. Nice. Time for that. Do I want to? Do I want to make them mad? That is the question. Building officer corps, that's a thing that we needed to do for a mission, I believe. What are the next parts of the mission? Grand reopening, I need the Marhold Tunnel. Is that even available? No. None available yet. Marching on marches, I need that province. Alinek indeed, I need those provinces. And I need five barracks. That's next on the list. Build some barracks. Hey, coalition's going away. Good. Alright, coalition's gone. Which means it's time. Severed ear. Oh, that'll be a big fight. Nurse Esther. Nurse Esther. You know, same thing. I believe... Yeah, I could get some big bucks, but I kind of want missions done. Yeah, let's just get them. That should be four, so I'll need one more after that. Alright, that's not so bad. Okay, what are we looking at for separatism? How far you got? You got two years. Uh, you have six years. Oh, right, yeah. I was building forts. I was building forts. Did I get this one? No. Did I get this one? Yes. Yeah, I was building forts because, um, here's the word. Uh, first, let's grab these, because the, um, the Crimson Deluge is coming. What am I looking at on that? It's like, eh, it's about that even. Okay. Good for them. You are at, yeah, you're the one at two years. I think these should be fine overall. It's not too bad. Sweating sickness. Under triple points or one stab? Hmm. What are we doing on tech? Yeah. Yeah, admin tech is way worse. So, we're losing the triple points because I don't need, I can't deal with the loan. Alright. I think we're just going to have to chill for a bit. Just because I can't afford to do anything else. You're allied with Regeria and Ilnor with the vassal of Stalbor. Oh. Good for you, I guess. What do we got? State fire enrichments. Yeah, let's do it. Very nice. That means our... We get drill gain modifier at the expense of land maintenance. Which I'm pretty fine with, actually. Let's grab the last one of these. Alright, there's that. And now, working on forts. I need those forts. Yes. Give me the money. Kaforia, no. 
go away. I need forts. Let's grab that one. Okay, that'll get all of that area. That's nice. And then it gets flat. And then it gets flat. Yup. Ooh, free money. We'd love to see that. Put it on this. Yeah. I'd rather grab the tech, because we're way behind on tech. Wow, that was fast. Um. Hmm. Are they still missing their air? Of course they're not. Of course they got an air. Good for you. Good for you. I spent points on that, and you just got rid of them. That shouldn't be allowed. That honestly shouldn't be allowed. That's just... That's just mean. You're ready. Ah, you're ready. Yeah, just make a Marotic. Yeah. I want to be Marotic, so they're going to be Marotic. How about that? And Cardesi, seek protection. I can't afford it. They can move. Where are they going? They'll move somewhere. They'll move here. Now. We got the thing. Room for improvement. That's the five barracks and 40 cavalry combat ability. Whilst our people have practiced the art of griffin writing for more than a thousand years now, war itself is changing. New technological advancements and tactics have made all that we knew about warfare outdated. And if we want to assert ourselves in this new chaotic Ascan, it's time to come up with advancements of our own, which gives us idea cost and miltech cost. 20 years. Let's see. Survey Corps, I need Eswick. Where is that? S. Wick. Which one's that? Oh, that one. Cool. Easy. I just need us, Wick. Many of our military staff have suggested the formation of a brand new military organization inside our realm. The Survey Corps. A corps of professional soldiers focused on reconnaissance and fast movements to complement our regular armies. Let us find fund this initiative to ensure our armies are never again outmaneuvered. 5,000 manpower. For, and I got a green company. Cool. Steel Griffins. I need three weapons manufacturers. That'll be expensive. Auxiliary units. I need 12,000 cavalry. We'll get there. That I need. And those are our conquest missions. All right. And Wings of Freedom. I need money. And a good advisor. But for now, that's an idea group. We're going to go for court ideas. I saw this in one of the comments. And I think it actually works really nicely for us, considering we're Escan. Devil Rep is going to help. be helpful. All state loyalty, yeah. They're just never gonna care, yeah. Max privileges per state, we're gonna get rid of that eventually. Max absolutism, yeah. I haven't done this for a while. I think I did court when I was doing a um. What are the volcano tours called? Gorbarad. I was doing that as one of the off-camera playthroughs. It was a fun one. I enjoyed it. Uh, let's see. Where to next? All right, we need to project into there. So grab that province. Project into the plains as much as I can. Cultural unrest. Nah. Stop. Death of a merchant. Um. Nah, I need the money. And you have development. Alright. Let's grab some more forts. That one and probably this one then. Queen consort of the people? No, I'll take the legitimacy. Yeah, 15 a month is enough to start building these forts. And oh boy, do I need these forts. I believe White Walls of Castanor gives a defensiveness bonus. Yes, it does. Good. Yeah, and I think the rest of these have, um, yeah, religious, religious zeal sounds about right. Yup. That's fine for now. Everyone wants, can't go for it, dude. Here's the three centers of reformation, which means it's going to be a, since they're all over here, that means it's probably going to be a weak reformation. Yeah, that's too bad. That is too bad. No one wants to work. Great. 
Thanks. Yeah, give me that. And you get to be converted. Very cool. This one can, but I'd, I would want something next to it to go first. So that'd be you. Yeah, they'll have to wait. Let's see what we got here. I want favors. Why don't you trust me now? 67. Not bad. How close you on that? Oh, they'll do it now. Nice. We lost a guy. That's too bad. Well, let's do Diplo Rep. Don't need to create favors with you anymore. I need to make you love me instead. Yep, there's Skinderak. Uh, ha ha. Two of a kind, level three Commandant. While I would love that, I can't afford it. Nah, we'll just keep everyone happy for now. Okay. Well, she's good at least. Oh, we're fighting elves. We are fighting elves. Yep, they won't go through, so it's fine. I guess I'm just fighting. I'm not actually going to do anything. No, just, no, no, whatever, you know. Hey, we're home. I have that. Let's give you the guarantee. Aggressor expansion is going to take a while to come down. Allied to rival. Do have a council league? It sounds about right. Army career? Honestly, the merchants need to be happier. Let's see what else. Give you access. Offensive dogma. No quarter. These vile bastards stand in defiance of all that Corrin has wrought. All that she would do to... Uh, all she would have us do to better the world. Strike hard. Strike without mercy. That we might drive these wretches into Narat's cold embrace. Straight to the hell that they deserve. Which is, we take more damage, but we also deal more damage. Now let's see. Rubber Barons. Base tax. Base production. That sounds wonderful, actually. In Bane's Fork. Yeah, whatever, Grimbar. Oh, right here. Bane's Fork. Which is... Come on. Give me the province. First. Yeah, I'll take it. Grumbar is no longer a valid rival. Loser. Nope. Oh, there we go. I guess it's time to go kill them. Not you. Uh, Iron Hammers. Give me your trade, please. Thank you. Oh, there are a lot of them. Oh, they sent their whole army after me. Oh, how wonderful. Great, great. Um, General Estates is probably the best one here. Yeah, I definitely don't want to go Parliament, because I have... <laughs> uh, let's see. Royal Decree? Yeah, that's okay. Aristocratic Court is Diplo Rep, Improved Relations. It's actually decent. States General gives me that. I don't think that's good for Marhold. I don't think that fits. General Estates is... All estates are more loyal. You get more monthly reform progress. Or aristocratic court. I think aristocratic court works best for this one. Yeah. Diplo rep and improve, improve relations and monthly favor growth. I think that works best for Marhold. Because that's kind of what we are. And we got something here. Well, all those are worthless except that one has some value. So we'll do that. Oh, and the general just died. Wonderful. Let's get the speed down. This is Grasslands. So let's just kill him. No, we don't have the morale. Now we'll kill him. Yes, thank you. Cool. That fort will come in eventually. Oh, someone's coming up. Dead Fang. Well, it's all protected at least. You can stay right there. Go get him. And there's the king. Whoop. Orcs, we're going to let him in because we're being nice to orcs. Is that a... That's a good air. I'll take that. And now that you're in, I'll grab the stability. It's not a regency anymore. There we go. Much better. And what trait did you get? You got benevolent. 
All right, very nice. Yeah, I don't really see how that's going to get any better. Huh. Hey, we got it. Nice. Let's go get him. That's fine. It's just a little bit of devastation. That's not so bad. You're coming over here. I'm going to grab the tech first. That's what we need. I've done my job. What's my participation? Like 40%? I'm fine. I've done my job here. Oh, there it is. There's the 11th Pantheonic Council. Which means it's about time for that to happen. Very fun. Uh, you need to stop drilling. I'm going to go hide over here. The 11th Pantheonic Council. Followers of Balgar tend toward magnificent tombs. Adherents of Munas are given the waves. Those of the dame are buried by the light of the moon. What kind of funeral do you give a god? That is one of many questions that the 11th Pantheonic Council of the Regent Court has set to set out. Set out to answer. Every high priest of every temple has taken the mural of Castellar in magnificent rendition or having gone to Aelantir to see it in person. They have seen one or two even touched his shattered scepter. And they have borne witness, as most Kanor has come to believe in his death. With not even a whisper from the gods to contest it, the gathered representatives of each god have expected discord over the claim of Castellus' death, unprecedented in the history of the court, but there was little. Even Castellus' own representative, an aged Castellarian refugee, was more relieved to finally have an answer to the question that had twisted his soul for decades, why the Silver Dragon did not come again. Instead, most of the debate has been around what happens next. Traditional Cast Canorian succession law would have his son, Adian, take the throne. But that was rooted in the traditions of Castellus' favorite, favorite country, Castanor. With him gone, with that old empire gone, does it really still apply in the court of the gods? Adherents of Corin, led by Dominic of Gallowspeak, now wizened with more than nine decades of age, but still a member, member of her circle, a recorder of her teachings, a speaker of her truth, argue otherwise. Instead, they claim succession would obviously be a contest based on merit one at which, surely, the heroine of the Green Tide excels. Moreover, she inherited the legacy of Agrados, Castellus' brother, and thus has a dynastic claim as well. The priest of Adian's mother, Esmeral, and his sister, Riala, are quick to back the god of chivalry and righteousness. Many others, especially the priests of Nathalene and Fala, are not so sure. This debate has raged for weeks, and may rage for weeks more. But one thing, at last, there's agreement. Castellus is indeed dead. All of Kanor, all of Halan, shall mourn him. And the world will never be the same. Yeah, we'll do the staff it to declare war. We're gonna do the staff it to declare war. That's fine. Alright, there's the there's the tick. Let's see what happens. Uh looks like you're ready to be Meridic. You're not. And these guys, well you are. Yeah, you're not gonna I'm not gonna make you be common goblin. No thanks. I'll wait. Oh, they're being dumb. Oh, they're being really dumb. Go get them. Night of Fire is nigh. A powerful Cardesti Diviner has sent us a message warning the court of a devastating fire to descend upon Dragonfell. Cardesti claimed that it is impossible to know when exactly this would unfold, but they are certain the fire is going to happen and destroy some important buildings in the town. How seriously should we take their warning? I don't think I've ever had the fire actually happen, but we'll do this. Move to development to uh, the Red Provinces, because I want to culture convert this. I want to culture convert it, and it's green, so it's not really a big deal. Alright. Now this area is covered. And I have some money. Enough to work on the rest of this. It's all flat. Okay. That line goes over here, so I think we're putting one here to project into that. Yeah, I have two ports next to each other, but they're this one's projecting onto the planes, so it's a little different. Hmm. How else to make them love me? Really just gotta take time, I guess. Clean spot official, eh, get him, get him out of there. Nope, oh, they're coming back. Uh, yeah, that's fine, let him in. Brilliant Rebellion. Alright, kill. Very cool. We're not going to drill during this war. Hammerhelm's done. 
I'm losing claims. Oh well. Diplomatic approach of Robin. Uh, yeah, so Robin of Griffin's Gate, I believe that's you. Yeah. Uh huh. Saying that she's good at diplomacy. I don't believe you. That usually only triggers when they have a high stat. Jessica can trigger whatever. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, I don't particularly want to convert the goblin goblins anyway. I'll let them stay as their current iteration, I suppose. Carol's dead. Not the one I'm using, so I don't particularly care. Iron ore quality, that's fine. Attack, we're gonna take it. Now oh, they're coming out. I suppose I'll go help. Fool. Die, please. Thank you. And admin tech. tech technology, please. There we go. Now we're caught up. Good, I can start doing ideas at some point soon. There's just really nothing else I can get them to like me with. The allied arrival really sucks. I want both of them to like me a lot. You, know what, you can give me your trade power too. Hey, there we go. There's the war. Good for you. Let's go fight them. I don't want to deal with it. So we'll go do that, and then come back over here. Thank you. We've got a guy. Um, don't really need a level two. But I suppose I will for one of these missions. I need one. Is it you? No. What other missions I need for one? This one, Wings of Freedom. Grand Captain, Commandant, or Army Reformer. Needs to be at least level 2. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta do that before it starts getting more expensive. They're all the same price. You're the cheapest to hire, so we'll do that. Oh, this is a uh, defensive war. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just against the one. That's not bad at all. Oh, and you. Die. Ooh, they got out. Crazy. Let's go get this guy first. Eh, he's coming around. That means I'm probably going to have to go down to speed four for this war. Just because they're just zooming around. Oh boy, they are zooming. Get this. And now come up here. Oh, is that a military attack I could take? What attack are these guys on? Attack 10, attack 11. Mm, I should be able to take them. Bro. Am I still gonna win? They have a... War Wizard. I'm gonna retreat from that fight. It's not worth it. I'm gonna win. Never mind. Apparently, I'm just gonna win that. Apparently, I just win that. Okay. Oh, look. There's so many more of them. Oh, Bladebreaker, please help. Give me the backup. Yes. You know what? I didn't expect that. We're now out of men. But hey. Why are there so many of them? <sighs> Scientist is dead, of course. You're really gonna do it? Really just gonna be like that, huh?
Come on, get him. Come on. Boo. Why are you like this? That is... Forest? I'll take it anyway. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, they did make it. Come on. Retreat. Not a good fight. Uh, this is not a good fight. But we did stop them from that, which is good. You're going after that? Good. Good choice. This is Conquest of... Monsters Conquest. Got it. Yeah, so I have no troops, so I'm going to go and hire the green mercenary group. Where are you? Griffin Knights. Holy moly, that's scary. Yeah, 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 I'm losing money, whatever. Oh, look at that, auxiliary units. <laughs> As our army grows, some among our leadership think it would be wise to reconsider how we use our griffins. Traditionally, they have only been given out to our knights and heroes. Perhaps there are other military roles for which our feathered friends are uniquely suited for, such as one for the courier. Restructuring the army, which, uh, okay. Cool. Ten regimental camps. I'll get to that eventually. Alright, let's core convert. Sounds good. Are you ready? Yes, you are. Very cool. And then the orcs. Eh, the orcs can stay orcs. That's fine. As long as they're green orcs. And nothing special. They can stay orcs. Farmlands? Kill. And the cavalry has arrived. Yeah! Shock damage! Lost a lot of guys because they were not unified. Yeah. That's why we do this. Let's just go up to speed 5 so we can regain some guys. Religious zeal, missionary strength, and clergy is more loyal. This is woods. Let's see what you can do. Cottage industry. You know what? Merchant guild can be mad. Oh, nice. I mean, I lost a good chunk of them, but that's... Totally fine, actually. You can go deal with them. We're gonna come over here. That's the play. Because these guys have a war wizard. I don't want to deal with that. Yep, there's the loans. Alright. Sea Drace. Cardesi volunteers. They want to join the army, but, like, it's expensive, so no. Okay, we got that one. Good. Maximum military points. I guess we're taking the military talk. Thorn Formation. The Thorn Formation was a mixed infantry formation of pikemen and musketeers. Because of this combined arms approach, the formation simultaneously enjoyed both the rigidity of its heavy infantry and the long-range firepower of its musketeers, making an ideal defensive and offensive formation. Originally developed by the Laurentish general Darien Sil in Inathen during its Wars of Dominion against Gawed, it proved that a smaller, defensive, and elite Laurentish force could defeat the larger mass of Gawedi infantry, who at the time were still primarily using melee weapons. Very cool. Um... You know, is there any way to make him not a rival? I don't think I can. Now, I can break alliances, not rivalries, which is kind of dumb. But, you know, whatever. Oh, influence nation. That's another way I can do I can get it. Get opinion. Okay. Got the war wizard out of here. That's important. You're going to go get that. You're going to go get that. Ooh, what do we have? Wings of freedom. There's my money. Yeah. After the survey corps was established, we realized another boon it offers. It gives ambitious soldiers and officers an excellent opportunity to prove themselves. As such, we will make sure its leadership is in the hands of the best commanders of Marhold, so that the next generation of warriors benefits from their experience as well. Eh, uh, yeah. Movement speed for 20 years. I'll take it. There goes my money. The dude let me through. Why are you like this? Let me through. Of 
Kavoria wants that royal marriage. That sounds wonderful. Yeah, I didn't think so. Adventurers route the goblins. Adventurers take on countless quests from exploiting ancient ruins to unraveling mysterious spells. The bards would have you believe that no two quests are alike. They miss, of course, the one quest that almost every adventurer has taken on at some point or another. Killing goblins. It is thus no surprise that the recent foray into the goblin lair in Temanath went smoothly. The lessening of their numbers should be a welcome relief to the locals. Yes, I'm very glad that in this world goblins are people and not like they are in Goblin Slayer. Because, haha, haha. Goblin cave to goblin sculptors. Well, that's helpful, at least. Oh, making money, look at that. And we got that. Let's go grab the capital and tell them to go away. Times of need. Um, I want admin points of Raven March. Yeah, give me your admin points, thanks. Helping hand. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Yeah, that's a regular leader. Good. Go deal with that immediately. Great. Ah, uh, well, they got caught, and now they're dead. When did Cloud and I get it on this? <sighs> Great. Now there's more guys in on this? That's awful. Why are there so many of them? Why are there so many of them? There's too many orcs. Yeah, just go kill them. Die. Thank you. Whoa, good stack wipe. Let's go get this. Okay, don't need that. Did not expect you to get in on this, but, you know, whatever. Coming on, Stead. Of course he is. He served his purpose, so that's fine. Why are we losing military points? War taxes are up. Right, right. That makes sense. Haha, -ha, I got it before you got here. Sucks to suck, dude. Ah, great. Yeah, we did not win that at all. Yeah, playing on speed 5 is uh, bad when the game actually runs properly. Ugh, why are there so many orcs? Why are there so many orcs? Why are there so many orcs? Hmm. Am I Defender of the Faith? No, that means I can just get out of this war if I feel like it. Hey, uh, dude, you want out? You want to let me out? No. No. Uh, Alright, this war is going to bankrupt me. means I gotta take out loans. I don't want to take out loans. Loans are expensive. But I suppose that's what it takes. It's not quite big enough for a second stack. What do we have here? 1488? It's actually pretty decent for this time period. Yeah, but it's not ready for that yet. So I still gotta clear out these guys, which means I need local adventurers to come help and just deal with numbers. Oh! Who did I have? Griffin Knights versus the Griffin Survey Corps. Oh, this is a totally different thing. Oh! They come from up there. Well then. Didn't expect that. I was using the wrong company. Holy moly, there's a lot of them. They're going to die. That'll do. No. Kill him. They retreat. Alright, they're stupid. Go kill them. So many of them. Oh my goodness. Why are there so many? Hmm. 
Well, we got Clouded Eye out of this, at least. They didn't give me any land! Now I have a truce with them! Alright, let's see what we got. Yeah, just give me the Dipple Points. It's fine. Whatever. Oh, they're scared. Can't get him there. I'll come over here. Alright. Get him now! How much money am I losing? A lot. Sevedere, can you just let me out? Thanks. Yeah, I don't want to be here anymore. Well, Hammerhelm's dead. Yeah, I lost that warp. Oh well. It happens. I'm still losing money. Well, I guess I'm reinforcing, so it's not that bad. You know what? I need loans anyway. Merchant Guild, give me... Yeah, we're just gonna do it. Da da da, in debt to Merchant Guild, thank you. Uh, we're gonna do a sell C's as well. Any buildings I need? No, it's not, it's not up anyway. Sell C's. Yeah, let's do a, um... Yeah, they have enough there. Aid construction, cool. 10%. I want the rest of these forts in. You get a fort. And then everywhere else is completely flat. Alright. Alright, so let's look at forts. Da -da -da. Can't grab one there. I suppose we grab one here. That would be a good spot. But it's not the end of the world. I think that's everywhere now. I think that'll be everywhere covered. Nope, we're missing one province. We would be missing one. So let's grab that, and then that. Now we're still missing one. Hmm. No, grab that one then. Alright. There's the forts. Any of these really useful while I'm here? Cool. Now we're going to get rid of the big loans. And I definitely want, um... Where are you? Control the monetary policy. Because that'll make things a lot cheaper. And it'll help with the inflation. Yep. Isn't that fun? Isn't that fun? Oh, this little vassalize. Nice. Well, I guess that worked out in my favor. Okay. Well, that worked out. <laughs> cool. Didn't expect that to work out, but it did. So, there we are. These guys are my vassal now, and they have a lot of cores. Are those all dwarf provinces? Yes, they are, which means they're not going to lose their cores unless... <laughs> unless something funny happens. I really hope it doesn't. Yeah, we don't need most of these forts on right now. Those forts can get... Ah, it, it only works for the one. That's dumb. I was really hoping it would do it for all of those. We don't need these forts on. Not until the Crimson Deluge starts. But that war was dumb, and it took a long time. So the episode's done now. I hope you enjoy it, and I hope to see you next time.